this one. Oh man, that would have been the best version for the post. Please tell me this is it. We've reached the milestone. Come on, come on. Oh, hi, Manaton. I really liked watching your show. My life is pretty boring, but seeing you on the screen brought excitement to my life vicariously. I can't tell, but I guess this is the last episode. I'll miss you, Metaton. Oh, I didn't mean to talk so long. Oh. No, wait, wait, wait. Uh, they already hung up. I'll take another caller. Metaton, your show made us so happy. Metaton, I don't know what I'll do. I'll watch without you. Metaton, on oh, there's a Metaton shaped hole in my Metaton shaped heart. I see. Everyone, thank you so much. Darling, perhaps it might be better if I stay here for a while. Humans already have stars and idol, but monster, they only have me. If I left, the underground would lose its spark. I'd leave an aching void that can never be filled, so I think I'll have to delay my big debut. Besides, you've proven to be very strong. Perhaps even strong enough to get past Asgore. I'm sure you'll be able to protect humanity. It's all for the best, anyway. The truth is, this form's energy consumption is inefficient. In a few moments, I'll run out of battery power and, well, I'll be alright. Knock him dead, darling. And everyone, thank you. You've been a great audience. Yay! I did it. Oh.
Mataton. Mataton. Are you... Thank God, it's just batteries. <laughs> Mataton, if you were gone, I would have... I would have... I mean, hey. It's no problem. You know. He's just a robot. If you mess it up, I could always just build another. Why don't you go on ahead? Nothing from looking at him? Okay. Oh, I can't believe it's over. I'm going to regret not going back to that save point, aren't I? Sorry about that. Let's keep going. I really regret not walking back to the save point. So you're about to meet Ashgore, huh? You must be pretty excited about that all of that, huh? Alphys, please don't kill me. You'll finally, you'll finally get to go home. Wait. I mean, um, I, I was just going to, um, say goodbye and... I can't take this anymore. I, I lied to you. A human soul isn't strong enough to cross the barrier alone. It takes at least a human soul. And a monster soul. If you want to go home, you'll have to take his soul. You'll have to kill Asgore. I'm sorry. I'm just hoping to get to a save point. I thought there was something more with Alpha, so maybe I'm forgetting it. This is a really long elevator. Um. Okay. Save point, please. Yay! Guys, <sighs> all later. Doing it twice. Was I supposed to take that other elevator? I just went up a really long one. This is like the beginning of the game. time ago a human fell into the ruins injured by the fall the human called out for help Azrael the king's son heard the human's call he brought the human back to the castle There's a heart-shaped locket inside the box. There's a worn dagger inside the box. Will you take it? You equip the locket. Room under renovations. Over time, Azrael and the human became like siblings. The king and the queen treated the human child as their own. The underground was full of hope.
Then, one day, the human became very ill. The sick human had only one request, to see the flowers from their village. But there was nothing we could do. The next day, the next day, the human died. Azrael, racked with grief, absorbed of the human soul. He transformed into a being with incredible power. With the human soul, Azrael crossed through the barrier. He carried the human body, human's body into the sunset, back to the village of the humans. Azrael reached the center of the village. There he found a bed of golden flowers. He carried the human onto it. Suddenly screams rang out. The villagers saw Azrael holding the human's body. They thought that he had killed the child. The humans attacked him with everything they had. He was struck with blow after blow. Azrael had the power to destroy them all. But Azrael did not fight back. Clutching the human, Azrael smiled and walked away. Wounded, Azrael stumbled home. He entered the castle and collapsed. His dust spread across the garden. The kingdom fell into despair. The king and queen had lost two children in one night. The humans had once again taken everything from us. The king decided it was time to end our suffering. Every human who falls down here must die. With enough souls, we can shatter the barrier forever. It's not long now. King Asgard will let us go. King Asgard or will give us hope. King Asgard will save us all. You should be smiling too. Aren't you excited? Aren't you happy? You're going to be free. Okay, I'm... This is probably the shortcut. Yes, it is. Okay back because I know one thing for sure I need more healing items again because there's no way I'm surviving Asgore <laughs>